Gerard Piquet's mother is devastated about her grandkids. 2013 is starting to be the year of the breakup diss tracks. On the day of her ex-husband Liam Harmsworth's birthday, Miley Cyrus released a cryptic new song promoting self-love and critiquing previous relationships. In contrast to Cyrus' ode to singlehood, a new scandalous retribution song has emerged and is stirring up even more controversy. With Argentine DJ Bizarrap, Shakira co-wrote the song, which is now her most recent single. She expressly insults her ex-boyfriend, footballer Gerard Piquet of Barcelona FC, as well as his mother, his new girlfriend, and other family members in the letter. Piquet will be disappointed to see that the song has broken all prior YouTube records for most views of new Latin music. Shakira and PK's split has been messy since the very start. Additionally, their protracted custody battle for their two children, Milan and Sasha, only made things worse. Montserrat Bernabou, the mother of PK, was one of those who vehemently opposed their divorce. PK's mother is reportedly quite upset by her son's breakup with Shakira, according to a report in the Spanish magazine Lecturas. According to a report, she experienced nothing short of a trauma during the separation. According to a news report, she is devastated. According to additional reports, the singer has forbidden her children from referring to Bernabeu as their grandmother, and this has caused PK's family significant distress. The former Barcelona star and the hips don't lie singers should patch things up, according to Bernabeu, who has long urged on it. She has a strong bond and is very close to her grandchildren. She says, she was reportedly the children's main caregiver while their parents were gone at work. According to the outlet, at their grandmother's house, the youngsters would frequently eat dinner and complete their homework. Additionally, Shakira's connection with PK was damaged by her mother being seen with Clara Chiamarti. The Spanish publication also detailed a number of incidents that strained the singer's relationship with PK's mother, who is the Tefelicito hitmaker. The 45-year-old singer allegedly put pressure on her son in a social media post that Bernabeu disproved of, according to the publication. The fact that PK's parents were seen out and about in La Sendaria with him and his new lover, Clara Chia Marti, was a second source of controversy. It served as clear evidence that they weren't entirely critical of his relationship with the 23-year-old. Eventually, the network of businesses that had united the families split up as well, metaphorically bringing an end to the union as well. In her song Bizarrap, the Whenever, Wherever singer also made a reference to her friendship with Gerard Piquet's mother. You left my mother-in-law as my neighbor, according to the song's lyrics. To no effect, Bernabeu tried her best to persuade the two to make it work. Shakira's relationship with straight PK's parents, particularly with her mother-in-law Montserrat Bernabeu, continues to deteriorate. The singer would have urged her kids Milan and Sasha to refrain from calling Joan PK and Montserrat's grandparents in Catalan, Avi and Ona, since it makes her unhappy. As a result, the children's paternal grandma suffered. The agreement between Shakira and her ex-husband has never been simple, but it has grown more difficult as a result of the singer's divorce from the soccer player. Her parents' support for Clara, her new girlfriend, and the direct criticism the lyrics of Session 53 have brought to the family. In a recently released video, Shakira can be seen observing how the mother of the former soccer player, who is very serious, touches her face before putting her fingers to her mouth in a clear shut-up gesture during an event they attended years ago. Shakira has preferred the woman as my little mother-in-law in the good times of their relationship. PK, who was present when his mother asked his wife to remain silent, turned away and carried on a conversation with a fourth person while oblivious to the difficult situation Montserrat was in with her daughter-in-law. Asking her kids not to call their grandmother would have ultimately destroyed her because it would have given the Colombian one more means of retaliation, joining the life-size statue of the woman she had erected on her terrace, facing his in-law's home and his allusion in the lyrics of his most recent hit, You Left Me As A Neighbor To The Mother-In-Law. The singer's degradation of Montserrat's bond with her grandkids has left her feeling extremely upset. PK's parents claim that a doctor was upset with her ex-daughter-in-law even on Three Kings Day. 
the children were with their father and their grandparents in their house in La Cerdaña, and she constantly called her children, who spent more time with their phone than enjoying the day, said those familial. And she told Gerard to stop the situation now, that it could not be that the children did not even want to go to her house, they added. Although PK's mother, a doctor and co-director of the Gutman Foundation, at first disapproved of her son's relationship with Shakira since she was older and not Catalan, she later warmed to the singer after becoming a grandmother at the age of only 50. When she was still in college, Montserrat gave birth to her son at a very young age and was hardly able to enjoy him. According to the doctor's entourage, who spoke to the magazine Lectures, these sentiments of love and thanks were what led her to seek out Shakira when she was already beginning to dispute with her son Gerard, and he ended up leaving home, which made him suffer more than normal. Shakira apparently became sick. Her work rate altered, she went unrecognized and wasn't treated like a star at one point. With Montserrat by her side, she experienced multiple depressed episodes. According to the same reports, the sports businessman's mother worked for reconciliation until her son informed her it was impossible, which is when he started to establish a relationship with the artist. She was the one who convinced PK to sign the paperwork allowing the kids to travel to Miami with their mother. Every day that passes here is a torture for Shakira, and it is better for children to have a clear life horizon," Montserrat even told her son. The history of the relationship between the Colombian and the former soccer player has been significantly influenced by him. She accused the singer of exerting pressure on her ex as a mother-in-law and made the decision to wager on their separation. Shakira's fury was ignited when she learned that her in-laws had started legal proceedings to distance themselves from the Colombian businesses in which they had roles as partners or administrators. They had also been spotted socializing with Clara Cha, her husband's extramarital lover. The doctor urged her son to cease showing up with Casio watches and Twingo automobiles in order to avoid escalating her former daughter in tremendous law's fury stop heating her up any longer. She also told her relatives that she had made it obvious to him that they needed to stop. In related news, Joan P.K., the father of Gerard P.K., is being challenged by Shakira. P.K. and Shakira have been at odds since their breakup over a number of legal disputes involving their property rights, ownership of their opulent private jet, etc. However, the Colombian songwriter defeated P.K. in the legal dispute over child custody. Sasha and Milan, the couple's kids, will continue to live with Shakira in Miami, but PK is free to travel there to see them. Shakira reportedly severed relations with PK's father, Joan PK, after their split. She distanced herself from the former FC Barcelona star's family, though after the couple split up, Shakira and Joan PK may need to engage in a legal dispute, according to reports. She is known to have assisted Joan in securing a number of sponsorship agreements. She works for Joan PK's business, Carad Holding. Although she isn't personally involved in running the firm, she has made numerous investments that have helped Carad Holding grow to where it is now. The Waka Waka singer also supported Cosmos, Gerard PK's business. She has facilitated the signing of multi-million dollar sponsorship agreements for Cosmos with organizations like Spotify. The Davis Cup tennis competition is partnered with PK's business Cosmos. At the Davis Cup closing ceremony, Shakira gave a performance. According to rumors, the Grammy-winning singer no longer wants any connection to PK or the company owned by her ex-father-in-law. It's still unclear, though, if she's attempting to get her father-in-law to pay her back. The Colombian singer, however, would undoubtedly want to resolve any legal procedures pertaining to her contentious divorce as quickly as possible. Let us know what you think in the comment section and don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button if you like this video. Also, we encourage you to click the notification icon so you won't miss any of our upcoming videos. Thank you and see you in the next video.